Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. I'm Christine Torres with the Law Office of Brian Fagan. Today we're diving into a topic that's at the heart of family law and child custody cases, which is, what is the best interest of the child standard? I'll be sharing knowledge on what courts mean by this term and how it often applies here in Texas. Imagine a scenario where parents are going through a divorce. Emotions are running high and both parents are trying to make the best decision that will impact their children's future. That's where the concept of the best interests of the child comes into play. So what exactly does it mean? Well, it's a legal standard used by courts to guide decisions regarding child custody, visitation, and other matters reflected to a child's welfare. Simply put, it's about prioritizing what's best for the child's overall well-being, growth, and development. To determine the best interests of the child, courts consider a variety of factors. Let's take a closer look at some of them. First, there's the child's physical and emotional health. We want to consider their age and any health issues they might have, while also ensuring their safety and well-being. Stability and continuity of care are crucial. Courts favor arrangements that provide a stable living environment and consistency in the child's daily life. The quality of the child's relationship with each parent matters. Courts value positive and loving bonds. Parental fitness is another factor. Courts evaluate the ability of each parent to provide a safe and supportive home. The history of caregiving is considered. Who's been the most involved in the child's life so far? Also, the ability to co-parent well is a key to a favorable and positive outcome for all parties involved. The court wants parents who can cooperate and make decisions together. Safety is a non-negotiable factor. Any history of abuse, neglect, or domestic violence is taken seriously. There's also the age of the child to take into account. Depending on the child's age, the child's preferences can be considered. We want their voices to be heard, and the court also aims to keep siblings together when it's in their best interest. It's important to remember in every jurisdiction, the goal remains the same, which is to prioritize every child's well-being and safety. Remember, in family law, it's always about putting the child first, ensuring their best interests are at the heart of every decision. Thank you for joining us today. If you found this information valuable, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and to hit the like button. We'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching this video. We hope it was both helpful and informative for you. At the Law Office of Brian Fagan, we are here for you. So please let us know how we can help you with your family law, estate planning, or criminal defense matters by calling our office today at 281-310-5563 to schedule your complimentary consultation. You can find all of our social media info in the description below. And if you would like to stay updated on all of our videos, events, and promotions, be sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking the notification bell.